This is the Headcore 93. It was a new ski last year, one that won a lot of awards, and that's not changed for this year either. We, um, ourselves, we've given it the Freeride Ski of the Year Award, and it's picking up awards all over the place again. So it suits a strong all-conditioned skier, people that want to ski everywhere, uh, soft snow, hard snow, any, anything on the mountain, but a stronger intermediate shouldn't be scared of it either because it's not a punishing ski to use. So it's a 16.4 meter radius in a 180 with a 93 millimeter waist. The key thing about it though is how light it is. It really is not a heavy ski. This is thanks to a graphene choroid carbon sandwich. So the graphene is in the tip of the tail. This is a really strong, really light material that's giving the ski excellent maneuverability. And the choroid is a, a honeycomb that runs right along the ski. It's keeping it light and it's absorbing shocks. Um, then the carbon's a triaxial weave that's just adding a little bit of extra precision for firmer snow without adding any weight. Um, the core in this ski is a Karuba, so again it's very light but it adds a lot of pop to the ski as well. And then the final thing is there's no standard top sheet on this ski, it's a polyester weave and that saves a lot of weight to it as well. So what you end up with is a ski with a very thin profile, a very light ski, a very balanced feeling ski, but one with a really fun, responsive ride. Hi, I'm Phil, store manager from Cambridge, out here in Obergurgel, Austria, just skiing the head Core 93 here. I'm super impressed with this ski. It's packed full of features. The thing that stood out for me was actually how lightweight it was. I took it out for a little bit of a hike, strapped it to my pack, and just tried to hit a few more lines that you wouldn't necessarily do off the, off the uh, side of the lift. Um, but equally, when he took it down into the hard pack, it was, it was equally impressive. Um, you could really carve and feel confident in those conditions. And when he got lower down the mountain, it got a bit slushy, it handled that well. It really is a versatile go-everywhere ski. I was super impressed.